Good morning and welcome to day 62. Well, good morning again and welcome to day 62. I am now on the other side of the river and up a pretty good ways. We're sitting about 2,400 feet um, and we're over three and a half miles into our hike. Uh, I hope everybody has a great day and I will come back at you later with the cool stuff. All right, talk to you later. Oh my, oh my, look at this view. This is freaking incredible. Here, I'll zoom in and show you it again. Oh, it's incredible. That's the James River down there in the bottom. All right, talk to you later. All right, guys, this is the cliffs. It's kind of similar to the view we had earlier. I think way down there, if you look, you can see the bridge that I had to walk across yesterday. But it's beautiful. Alright guys, here's another one. This is for Odie Klein Pals. Uh, this is where his body was found when he strayed away from his school on no no November 9th. The little boy walked a distance of seven miles and he was only four years eleven months. He was with uh, I read the story last night. He was with the uh, older boys because everybody went to the same school. And they were collecting wood and chestnuts and he did not see the other boys leave and go off to school and he was left by himself and he got turned around and went the wrong way and sadly this is uh where his body was found my heart goes out to any parent that has to bury their child. Alright guys, I'm on top of Blue Mountain. I just want to give you a quick view and then get down. It is blowing like crazy up here. Big gust just about blew me down. Used to be a fire tower here. This is the view. All right, moving on. All right, guys, I just wanted to come back to you. Again, it's day 62. I really didn't talk a lot or dedicate this hike to anybody in particular, at least if I did, I don't remember. So if I did, I'm sorry. Um, but today's Thursday. I think it's November 22nd something like that um november it's april 22nd i didn't sleep well last night sorry um we need real mattresses at hostels those little vinyl cover pads don't cut it especially for side sleepers all right but moving on don't want to be negative want to be positive uh i was out of the cold weather so that is important all right, um, today, uh, today I'm hiking for Grace. And I don't mean Grace as a person, I mean Grace as an action. Uh, grace, forgiveness, whatever you wanna call it. Um, so 
today would be a great day to serve up some grace to people that you run into. I know somebody out there is going to do something that you're not going to like, may upset you, um, but try to give them grace. You never know what they're going through in their life. Um, and if you were going to do the same thing, how would you react? So not only should you give grace to others, but more importantly, and where I'm going to focus, yes, I, I want to give grace to those that I meet, but I want to give grace to myself. Um, I'm pretty hard on myself. Um, I am kind of a perfectionist, so I hold myself uh, to a standard that probably is higher than it should be. Um, thank God grace is given to us every day by our Heavenly Father, because He knows, boy, we, uh, we mess up daily. But, okay, give some grace to somebody because grace is love. And it doesn't have to be a family member. It could be anybody. It could be that person at the grocery store next to you. Oh, by the way, if you notice, I'm bundled up. It's cold. It's very cold. And the wind is howling. So, uh, I'll be glad when these next two or three days are over, even though it's about to rain Saturday and Sunday. Um, I want to get back to some warmer, nicer weather. But I accept what it is and know, knew when I started that I was going to have to battle some of these elements. And that's what I'm doing. I will keep my chin up. I will keep pressing forward. And Katahdin is calling. All right, guys. Thanks for tuning in. Love you guys. I'll come back when I see something cool. Hey guys, this just happened. I don't know if you can read it. 800 baby, 800 freaking miles. Look at that. Oh, that's backwards. All right, well, it's 800 miles. I can't believe it. A couple more hundred and I'll be at a thousand. All right, talk to you guys in a little bit. All right guys, we made it to another suspension bridge. Let's see this, this one's quite as bouncy as the other one. It's shorter. So maybe we'll see some fish in the water. There's the right side. I do not see a single fish. Must be something over there, because I just seen this ripples. Oh, I see him down there. Little trout. All right, let's see what's on the other side. To get inflow there on the left. I don't see too many fish. It's got a muddy bottom, kind of yucky. I know trout like clear, good moving streams. All right, guys. So it's a little bouncy. Not too much. Not too bad. All right. I'm guessing we probably got a little less than five miles uh, to get to the shelter. All right, there it is. All right, we'll talk to you later. Hey guys, I just realized I hadn't done as the trail turns and I'm getting pretty close to being my stopping location for the night so um here's your episode of as the trail turns
Speed bump. White blaze. I'm gonna try to do a, another big day tomorrow since the rain's supposed to push in Saturday. I'll do a shorter day Saturday and hopefully uh, not get rained on. I guess we'll find out. Oh, there's a nice little stream coming down here. Look at that. Bonus, bonus footage. All right, now can I rock up and film? That's the question. Look at me go. You can hear the stream off to my right now. All right, well, that's going to do it for today's episode. I hope everybody had a great day. I hope you put a little grace in your life, and I'll talk to you later. All right, guys, I got to the shelter. It's your typical old six people shelter. I'm trying to decide if I want a tent or stay in the shelter. I know it's supposed to be cold tonight. Um, so, I don't know. I'm gonna have to figure that out. The wind's blowing, and it's blowing right down to the water, which is where the tent sites are, so we'll see.